This girl clout chases at the gym and shows why us guys should not pay attention to girls at the gym. How to not approach girls at the gym. So we're already five seconds into the video and this girl's already talking crazy. She's talking wild. She's talking ridiculous. If you didn't notice the words popping up on the screen, she called this guy a stupid fucking piece of shit. So already guys, that's that's wild words to be throwing out, wild words to say. I think we can all agree those are straight fighting words right there. Like if you're walking down the street and some random guy comes up to you and calls you a stupid fucking piece of shit, you beat that guy ass. I mean, I would assume, right? If not, you're probably just a bitch. For her to be saying such wild things, for her to be saying such crazy things about a guy she doesn't even know, this guy has to be doing some type of D1 weirdo stuff. Out of the box, out of pocket, like whatever this guy is doing has to be wild. It makes me so uncomfortable. So because this guy was staring at you, he's a stupid fucking piece of shit, that's wild. This girl feels so godly that guys can't even look at her. If you a guy and you look at her, you're a peasant. That, that's, pretty, that's pretty much what I'm getting out of this. So she's calling this guy a feral. If you don't know what feral is, it pretty much means you're wild. She's just overreacting. All this guy did was look at her. So what? If he looked at you, I mean, that, that's going to happen regardless. I can understand if she bent over and the guy was just staring at her ass like this. That's one thing and that, that's pretty much harassment right there, but that's not what's happening. He's not doing anything wild. He's just making some harmless glances. I'm a very attractive guy. I feel like we can all agree on this. Definitely more attractive than that girl, right? When people look at me, I feel honored, right? Like, I mean, they should be honored. They're looking at me. Look at me. The honor to look at me. I would never feel uncomfortable with someone staring at me because it's just so much of an honor to look at me. I mean, honestly, this girl should take notes from me on how to be a better person. People look at her. She starts clowning them. People look at me. I lift them up. That's what I do. I lift people up. See, there's really a difference between other people and me. This girl was contemplating screaming bloody murder? This girl has mental issues. Let's say she screamed out bloody murder. You know how it is in today's society. People can believe the girl. That guy's going to jail. That guy's going to jail. He's serving life. He might be getting fucked in a jail cell. We don't know. All because she said bloody murder because he was looking in her direction. That's wild. She could have potentially ruined this whole guy's life just because he was looking at her. Looking at someone in some ways is a form of validation. So this girl's about to ruin this whole guy's life for validating her. Now he's going to jail. Now his life is ruined because he stared at her. Mind you guys, the steer count is still at two. So I can only imagine what would happen if the steer count got to ten. She probably called this nigga a munch or something. There's mirrors everywhere so like you can easily catch people. Oh, this is nothing. Girl, you gotta up them weights, man. You're not making no gains. Alright, I'm gonna keep it all the way 100. He was going up with the stairs. He was staring like crazy. But still, so what? It's still harmless. He's not doing anything. He's not causing any type of physical harm or anything like that. So who cares? This is a gym. A gym is a public space. People are gonna look at you regardless. I mean, people are working out. People heads are gonna be turning and stuff like that. You want people to work out, look it up, put their eyes closed, want them to look down at the ground, look at their dick. What is the ideal scenario that you would want? The ideal realistic scenario that you would want to make you feel comfortable, right? Because people are going to look regardless. Like I said before, me, very attractive guy. I'd be in the gym, I'd be doing everything, pull-ups, squats, benching, muscles. Well, people are gonna look, right? People are going to look regardless. People be looking at you, you don't even know they're looking at you. That's just human psychology. It's human curiosity. People are gonna look at what they wanna look at. People are gonna look at what amazes them, which is why I said when people look at me, I feel honored as they should. What the fuck else is around you that's better than me to look at? Nothing. It's a, it's a trick question. Size. You just up the weight. Of course you're gonna look. You inspiring him. Why does the video end right when he's walking up to her? This guy to be clout chasing. Turns out I'm right. This is clout chasing because someone commented saying, did he approach you? And she pretty much said, go watch the full video on TikTok. Nick Oh, that's fine. Who's going on TikTok to watch that whole video? Not me, not you. If you are, LL promotion, honestly. If I go on TikTok to watch your video, because you know how when you go on TikTok and you click on someone's profile, it shows that you're viewing the profile. On a side note, man, I gotta call you out. All right, I don't really use TikTok, but when I do go on TikTok, I look at who's viewing my profile and who's watching my shit. Bro, I can literally see you. The least you could do is like. We like the same people. Like, I'm really some stalkers. How about they get out the trenches? Anyways, if I go on her profile, she probably starts talking junk and say, oh, all the people that are looking at my profile are weirdos and stuff like So, like, I'm not even gonna look at her profile and I really don't even care enough to watch the video in the first place, because that pretty much confirms why would you post a video up to a certain point and then say go watch the rest on my tiktok you're college chasing as simple as that the entitlement is just ridiculous this girl's talking mad crazy saying fighting words and all this type of stuff to a guy that she barely knows just because he was looking at her and then she's gonna go post this on social media thinking everybody's gonna gas her up like yeah girl yeah girl you're doing the right thing that guy's a weirdo he's a creep the comment section is clowning her goofy ass fuck wrong with her she literally set the camera and the microphone up to catch all this and the fact that the guy was there this whole time and didn't know that i'm not gonna lie he's kind of a bot that's called attention seeking that's the type of shit you do when you got an l relationship with your father you go to the gym do not be 
looking at girls, man. You look straight ahead, work out with your eyes closed, just look at the floor. I mean, not look at these girls because the next thing you know, you're going to end up on TikTok. You're going to be getting clowned, exposed, called a creep. And you know how they say keep your hands to yourself, so you got to keep your eyes to yourself too. Then again, most of y'all shouldn't even worry about this because most of y'all don't go to the gym. That nigga's lazy as fuck. Y'all sitting your ass all day and don't do nothing, but you don't got like two hours to go to the gym. That's wild. You know what, guys? Anyways, let me know what you think about this in the comments. I wonder if the guy found out about this. Like, imagine going on TikTok and seeing you on some girl's TikTok and she's calling you a creep. Anyways, guys, let me know what you think about this in the comments. How would you react? What do you think? Do y'all go to the gym? Are you guys staring girls down at the gym? I've trained myself to not look at girls. Now, obviously, I look, right? Like, that's, that's some shit you can't help. But, like, that, that staring shit or, like, when they, especially when, they, when they're in your vicinity, not, do not be staring at them. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna let you go. My name is Crazy, and I'll see you guys again when I drop another video.